this new law uh, just uh, changed uh, basically the rating system of a film. Uh, as I say before, the producer and distributor suggest a rating, and the new commission has to uh, approve it or not. So this uh, is the first time that we have a sort of self-regulation in the industry in Italy, instead uh, of uh, a state uh, control as we had up to now. And it's something that the producer really wanted for a long time, at least for the 1950s, they wanted to follow the American system in this way. Uh, as mentioned before, uh, the, most significantly, this commission cannot prohibit the distribution of a film or demand cuts and other changes in the text. Uh, if a film is deemed problematic, the commission can make it available only for 18 years old and over, and that's it. That's the only thing they can do. Uh, in the past decades, uh, we've, uh, we have few cases, to be honest, uh, in film failing to obtain the censor certificate needed for distribution. Still, uh, it's also true that this law represents a historical change about censorship policy in Italian film. And what will now change? Like, how much more freedom will the modifications to the law give filmmakers? Well, difficult to say. Let's say that uh, the idea of having uh, a final cut of a film uh, made by some uh, bureaucrat uh, somewhere is always something not very appealing uh, with a risk to go back uh, to redo the cutting, etc. of the film. Uh, so the big change is that there is not any longer the risk the film cannot reach the theatres because of some uh, decision uh, made for uh, censorship purposes, or even more, uh, the fact that they cannot recommend or suggest any longer any changes, etc., in the film. Uh, this is something that uh, is quite new. Again, as I say before, uh, to be fair, uh, the last big case of a film uh, was not given uh, a censorship certificate, uh, I was uh, in the 1998, a big film which was denied uh, in the first instance of distribution. So it's not as pressuring as it was probably in the 1960s, 70s. Still, uh, it is, again, a radical change with respect to the policy in the recent years. And is it true that sometimes falling foul of Italy's censorship laws has given films a boost? Yes, it uh, happened. Uh, more, uh, more interesting, I believe, uh, it is all the period of the 1970s, uh, 70s, 60s and 70s, where we had some, uh, let's say, film were looking for this sort of uh, polemics, etc. But also it is uh, true that uh, for some author cinema in the 1960s, they had actually the, the power to push back on it and to make the kind of uh, debate around the request, the cut and change it a matter of uh, principle and a matter of uh, uh, arguing for artistic freedom, etc.